The weather's finally getting nice, I'm going to show you a better way to make a highball. First thing you're going to need to do is get a jug, fill that with 500ml of hot water and brew yourself some tea. Whatever tea you want, Yorkshire tea is always best but it's up to you. After that we're going to go in with some citric acid. Alright, it's going to sour it up. Can you use limes or lemons? Yes you can, but this is better. We're going to go in with about a teaspoon, a teaspoon? A teaspoon of citric acid. Pour that right in like so. Give it a little stir around to dissolve it. Then we're going to go in with our scotch. We're going to go in with 300 millilitres of unbranded single malt or blended scotch. How much should I say? 300? I meant 250 millilitres. Next, you're going to get yourself a little solder siphon like I've got here. Screw that lid off. Put that to one side. Gently pour it in. Try not to spill it all. This does help if you have a funnel. Yeah, I'm realizing that now. Okay, screw the lid on. Now just gonna stick that in the fridge for about an hour, let it cool down. Once that's as cold as your refrigerator will let it be, it's time to charge it up. Unscrew the back, grab yourself a CO2 canister, put that in, into the back it goes, screw it on, release all that gas. Give it a good hard shake. Now that's going to get nice and lightly carbonated. Personally, I like me some bubbles. So I'm going in with a second canister. Same thing. Twist. And shake. Then we just need to put that in the fridge for about another hour. Let all that CO2 work its way into the drink. So I'm going to do that. Okay, so after you've got that as cold as you're going to get it, it's time to start releasing some of that gas. So if you put it upside down like that, all the liquid will be at the bottom, the gas will be at the top, that's what's going to be released first. So we're going to get a bit of towel in case we get any spray. And then you're just going to start releasing that gas. You're going to get some froth, that's okay. At that point, you can slowly undo it. Grab yourself a nice little glass, I've got one here little ice ball put that inside makes a nice little serve pour that right over mm -hmm. and there you go that right there that is a tea and scotch highball fully carbonated from the scotch to the tea have a little taste delicious bubbly citrusy that's how you take your highball to the next level give it a go let me know what you think